Wow. You look great. Thank you. Do we have time for a drink before we go? Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. <sighs> Layla, whatever, pick up after herself. <laughs> Can you believe this mess? It looks familiar, actually. Our old roommate days. <sighs> what? You, th you think this mess is mine? <laughs> no, no, no. I would have you know that I am now a neat freak. I always pick up after myself, and I do the dishes, and I... Fine. Fine. It's all mine, okay? In fact, the only piece of clothing in this room that isn't mine is this dress I'm wearing, which is Layla's, because I don't own anything date-like. So, I'm a slob. I'm a total pain in the ass because I don't eat meat, and I'm really arrogant about the music other people listen to, which is pretty damn obnoxious, but I guess... It's just because I'm a really difficult person. Listen, if you're trying to scare me, forget about it. Because I don't scare you. Neither do I. Right now I'm terrified. Excuse me. Didn't I know that you were expecting company? I wasn't. RJ just stopped by to see how I was doing, and I told you, so I guess you can go. No, no, not yet. I, uh, want to have a word with Bo first. Hey, give me a break. We're closed. The light was on. Daddy. You got an appointment? Are you so upset with me about the whole Miles thing? I told you I'm not into him. Oh, yeah, you're into that guy, uh, uh, what's his name? I was. Jared Buchanan. He's got the same name as you. Well, that'll make it real easy. Easy? Yeah, in case you get married to the dude. You don't have to change your name. Oh, see, I'm not marrying my uncle. What am I saying? He's your uncle. Yeah, and for whatever reason, I can't get him out of my head. Conduct unbecoming, especially for a Buchanan. Bad day? No, not at all. In fact, I just passed a test of fine color. If this is a celebration, you could have fooled me. Nash, if you would just let me explain. Just explain. I've heard it all before. You're doing it for your family. You're doing it for a noble cause. Nash, and if you gotta sell out your husband's vineyard from under him, well, that's just the price that he is gonna have to no, pay for you to execute your brilliant plan. I didn't sell the vineyard. I didn't sell it, okay? I knew that the rest of my family would vote the proposal down. But by voting with Jared, I am one step closer to proving to him that I am really Tess. Not just him. Excuse me? You are so convincing, I'm beginning to wonder myself. 